until Wednesday, when a petition against Portable reached the Inspector General of Police Office, the controversial musician had told his side of a story, largely absolving himself of guilt in the matter. But as is always the case, there's more than one side to this story. Well, ladies and gentlemen, in this composition, the notes are high and the controversies are even higher. This is the latest episode in the tale of the Zazu Kruna himself, Habib Okikiola, aka Portable. Portable is in the hot seat. He's not just hitting the high notes, he's hitting the headlines too. Our friend Portable has been summoned by the Inspector General of Police and even got a special invitation from the American Embassy. Why, you ask? Well, our friends from the USA, Dr. Fortunate, Egbuchere and Prince Egbuchere, both working and trading under the E-Square records, have some criminal allegations. According to the petition, the lawyer of the US-based singers alleged that the Zazu Kruna committed various types of crimes from criminal breach of trust, conspiracy, to assault, and even armed robbery. It's like a mixtape of legal troubles for portable. In fact, the crimes allegedly include criminal breach of trust, conspiracy, conduct likely to cause breach of peace, criminal conversion, armed robbery, stealing, criminal assault, assault occasioning harm, threat to life, criminal defamation, extortion, obtaining by pretense, false imprisonment, misrepresentation, and making of false information to the police. But hey, it's not just about the legal jargon. It's also about some serious showbiz drama. Our friends from across the ocean wanted to collaborate with Portable and everything seemed harmonious at first. They even agreed on a sweet deal of 2.5 million naira for audio and video recordings. What could possibly go wrong? Oh no, the plot thickens. Portable pulls a disappearing act on the day of a music video shoot, demanding an extra 1 million naira, like it's a VIP ticket to his concert. Don't fish me from America. Now, you go ever fish me when I give my manager 2.5 million. As my manager, give me the money. Then, now last year, they, drove, they give me money. This year, now I don't say price on. But wait, there's more. After some drama and a midnight rendezvous, our clients paid up and the video shoot happened. Spoiler alert, it didn't end well. Violence, thugs, police, just like a blockbuster action movie. Oh, I do the video for them. Oh. After they pay me one million again, I say, me, before I, I'm son go to Aja, Mama not to one million, man that will. So ten one million, give the balance. Go get three point five. As I reach there, I do video, do everything, no. Make I they go out now, they attack me, say I must refund you. Also in the petition, that in the course of assaulting our clients, Portable's manager mobilized thugs aided by some policemen, and our clients were thoroughly beaten. That is the cause of the assault on our clients. Portable with some of his thugs under the watch of the police, they locked the main entrance of the apartment and further assaulted our clients. That our clients managed to escape through the back door and were whisked away by good Samaritans as they are not familiar with the terrain. And here comes the grand finale. Portable proudly parades on social media, flaunting the loot, expensive cost Stumes stolen from our clients. Classy move, Portable. But that's not all. Portable decides to spice things up with some false publications against our clients. Because why not? It's showbiz after all. So grab your popcorn and stay tuned for the next episode of this musical drama. Will Portable hit a high note or a low blow? Only time will tell. If you enjoyed this, please like, 
share and subscribe so you can get notifications.